uh, I want to thank Toria and Rain for pointing out this uh, story about a Richard Spencer. Like, uh, Richard Spencer, who's a known white supremacist and one of the leaders of the so-called alt-right, um, he's recently in a, in financial shambles. Uh, he's being sued, and he, he's asking for people to help him with his legal with his legal woes and his legal financial fina uh, financial problems. But um, he apparently um, so something must something must be something must be uh, be be um. Uh, Something must be wrong if he gotta if he gotta ask total strangers to help him with his legal battles. I thought I thought he was uh, I thought he was getting all these major contributions coming from different sources, whether known or not. Um, Richard Spencer, who's a well-known white supremacist, who uh, who uh, who try to um, get, uh, try to give him try to he try, uh, he he went went around giving Donald Trump this furor uh, type of uh, mantra. And he's he's trying to uh, he's trying to be open with the white supreme with with his uh with his uh unapologetic white supremacist uh, re uh rhetoric, and now he's now he's uh, going through financial uh, problems and he's in financial shambles and he needs somebody to help him uh, while he's being sued. Why should we? And like um and don't this dude got money? Apparently he doesn't. If you gotta ask, if you gotta ask uh, people to help him, help him with out with this stuff. And you know something? I found out like um, you said this man is banned from twenty six countries. Twenty six countries. H how the hell did you get banned from twenty six countries? And th this goes to show you that uh, he he uh, like Richard Spencer is doing what he he's doing what other supremacists, white supremacists uh, don't do. They they uh they don't uh they don't come out in the open with cameras rolling and um and recorders uh, playing uh, uh, uh with them saying that they are uh, they're white supremacists or they hate a certain group of people because of their skin or because of their religion because the truth because the biggest white supremacists are the ones are are the ones that are. Uh, that are ones are the ones that uh, that are behind the scenes are the ones that you probably see in front of the camera, uh, but the, the uh, but the white the true white supremacists uh, if they do go in front of a camera they're not gonna uh, they're not gonna express their white supremacist views or they're, they're not gonna say that they hate a certain group of people because of the uh, skin color, yeah but they 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 still harbor those views but they're not gonna be all out in the open like that because they know they have too much to lose. Apparently, Richard Spencer, uh, uh, um. Richard Spencer tried tried to push the envelope, thinking that it was going to help him, but it really it's really not. And like a recently, like media takeout, they put out, uh, like a, they they showed these these stills of him, uh, with with some black girl in the background, probably his lover, because like uh like a, even, even though Richard Spencer he he's a white supremacist, but he loves Asian women. But like a, a media takeout has showed a picture of him with some black girl. In the background, while he was doing some webcam series. And like um, like uh, he uh, his his credibility. This man doesn't realize his his credibility is fragile. Okay, um, his his credibility is damn near destroyed. And um, and and now he, now he wants um, and now he wants um, he wants people to help him out. With, with with his financial woes, I don't I don't think so, dude. This is this is all on you. You should have known, like a uh, he he should have known better than to, than to uh, uh come out with the, with these uh with these blatant blunt uh uh with his blatant blunt rhetoric, a white supremacist rhetoric. He had he had to know that they had to come with a consequence. That that's why a lot of well known uh powerful white supremacists don't do don't do what Richard Spencer does or has done. Like like go out and uh. Uh, do the Heil Hitler salute, or say Heil Trump, or Heil Fuhrer Trump, and, and talk about and then talk about white this and white that. That uh, that that's something that uh, 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 white supremacists don't do because white. Well, see, here's the thing: people know exactly what not to say to not appeal a certain way. But then when you're, but then when you're somebody like Richard Spencer, who who chooses who chooses to go against the grain and, and go against a. Uh, Go against their uh, set rules. So it's like there's there's uh, consequences to your actions, and sometimes those consequences could be dire. Ask George Wallace.